Good morning, guys. So I want to have a transformation today. Like, I'm just over this. I try to do some lighter pieces in the front, and I just feel like it looks orange and disturbing. So I think I'm going to do split dye hair today. I've always wanted to do this, like, seriously, for about five years now. I've been wanting to do split dye hair ever since I saw Jesse from the neighborhood do split dye hair. I have always wanted it, so I'm going to attempt it today. Half blonde, half black, and yeah, let's come along on this journey with me because I am I'm kind of nervous. I'm never really nervous to do my hair, but like now I am for some reason. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I'm getting older and like I'm just like oh I can't pull it off as much, but that's not true like I'm gonna look way better than how I do now I look like literal poop poop so yeah I'm gonna split my hair I got some box dyes okay like don't make fun of me if I got box dyes um and box bleaches so all right I'm just gonna make it go on fast forward so I can listen to music and do this and calm myself down I'm just gonna brush my hair out and section it and yeah cool okay I'm just gonna brush everything out and try to control this mess a little bit all right I'm gonna do this side this side black this side white okay so I'm section sectioning off like the front pieces so I can do those later and then I separated the back into half. So I have that sectioned away. I'm gonna do this back section first. And just then do the top section in the back. And yeah, I have foils and stuff, I don't know. <sighs> so I'm using this colorista. just dumping the bleach box dye into my hand and then painting it on. This didn't really work however because it was like a makeup brush so I pretty much ended up using my hands for most of it. I know it makes it more splotchy but in the end I thought I would miss less parts so yeah. I thought I could like feel around. Um, sections or if any felt dry so that's pretty much what I did
bugs. All right, so this is the result of it. It's pretty orange at the moment, um, but it seems to be a pretty even color. Don't think I missed any crazy patches or anything. So I would say that's a win. Um, yeah, this is what it looks like. Still quite orangey, so I'm gonna go over this with the silver die I got and see if it makes any difference at all. I'm really surprised these front pieces didn't go as light as I thought they were going to. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to do the other side and to get this look completed. I can't wait. All right, I'm gonna go back over the section and just blow dry it a little bit and put some hair oils. And now I'm gonna go back over it and we'll see how this goes. All right. All right, so I pretty much finished the black and that's what the fuck my hair looks like. Um, this is the front of my hair, but this side is still wet. Um, I just washed it out and yeah, I'm gonna let the side stay for about maybe 15 minutes. Then I'm gonna shower and do my makeup and then I have to go to a meeting. All right, so I ran a few errands and stuff, but here's my hair fully dried. Yes, it's a little uneven. Okay, I know this part looks a little greasy. That's because I put uh, Vaseline here so the black wouldn't get on this side of my hair. And it ended up just making my hair freaking greasy and it's sticking down. So I think I'm gonna quick wash my hair or something. Uh, just this one part, because that section needs to not be looking wet. Um, yeah, so I don't think it's really that dark. I think it's just because it has the best lean on it. But I think I just need to get used to it. I'm just like, oh, I really want this hair, huh? <laughs> um, but I think I did a good job getting it half and half all the way. And that is a fact. <laughs> I'm excited. I love my hair. Even the blonde side, it has its faults, but it's not bright orange or bright yellow, right?